There's a hole in the Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you guys so much for joining me for today's home decor haul. I'm very excited to show you guys the last final pieces I picked out for my pre-fall home decor and yeah, I'm just really happy with all of them. I'm especially happy and content with the fact that these pieces are not only going to work for my pre-fall home decor but also are going to work for my fall vision and maybe even leading into Christmas and winter so they are definitely pieces that are gonna last me a very long time and pieces that I'm very happy to be able to add to my existing home decor so I hope this video gives you guys some inspiration maybe if you like some of these pieces you guys can go out and look for them or I will try to link as many of them as I can down below in the description box I am so ready to start decorating I'm actually gonna take down all my home decor today get the house all nice and tidy which is going to be the following video and yeah just basically get a clean slate so I can start decorating this week and have those videos out for you guys soon but yeah I'm very excited so I want to go ahead and get into showing you guys the item but real quick I just wanted to mention to make sure to wait till the end of this video because I will be announcing the third giveaway winner so we did cross 9,750 and we are well on our way to 10,000 subscribers which is so amazing. So not only will I be announcing the winner but I will also be giving details as to how the next giveaway is going to work. So definitely stick around but let's go ahead and get on to it. I want to show you guys what I picked up. As always if you guys enjoy this video please give me a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell because as you guys will be able to know in just a minute it's going to be really really important to have it on so nonetheless let's go ahead and get started with the first piece and actually i'm going to show you guys the one piece that really inspired my decor you guys know that i always have one piece that basically just gives me all of the creative energy that i need to come up with the vision and this one was it for me i hope you guys can see it but uh, I don't even know if you guys can see like the beautiful colors in this picture landscape a painting I don't know what to call it, but it does have an like brass finish like frame It is so pretty. I love all the fall colors in this This is from Target from the Studio McGee line I saw it as part of their sneak peek a few weeks ago and I absolutely knew that I wanted it and Oh my god, you guys, this was harder to get than a birdhouse from Ray Dunn a few years ago. Like, I remember how hard I looked for a Ray Dunn birdhouse, and this was probably even harder to get a hold of. It went out of stock immediately. I stayed up, not gonna lie, until 1 a.m. the day that this was gonna be released was not able to get a hold of it as soon as it went up it sold out i had the notification on to be notified when it came in stock and i kid you not i was probably notified like eight to ten times before i was finally able to get a hold of it i just absolutely love this so much i knew it was a piece i wanted for my home and the price was so good this was only 28 dollars. let me show you guys one more time Ugh. It was only $28, so I am so happy I was able to finally get a hold of it. And yeah, I'm really excited to display that in my home. Like I told you guys, I think landscape art or paintings are going to be very popular in home decor this season. So yes, yeah, so happy I got that. Plan B was to get a print off of Etsy and get a frame for it. But like I said, I'm very happy to be able to have that in my home decor. Next piece is pretty heavy and to be quite honest, these next two pieces are way bigger than I imagined them to be but it makes it even better and worth the price that I paid for them because both these pieces were $25 each and I told you guys in my last video I wanted to get them, I was eyeing them, I absolutely love them so much. This is the other one. So oh, I don't know if I could pick both of them up. This is both of them for comparison, but I 
I love them. I, I know they're bigger than I was expecting them to. And at first, I was kind of scared. I kind of thought about returning them. But after a little bit of thought and deliberation in my creative mind, I decided I'm going to keep them. I know they're going to work somewhere in my house. And again, they're just super huge statement pieces that, that will take up a lot of space and just really catch the eye. I'm planning on doing like some greenery in them, just something grand and big that'll really call your attention when you walk into my home but yes these are also from the studio mcgee line next up is this beautiful pillow right here i am so excited about this i saw liz marie galvan do a look last year and she had these type of pillows on her couch i absolutely fell in love with them last year but the ones she used um, if I am remembering correctly when I went to go check out the link they were a little bit pricey I want to say I mean I think they were like $42 or something like that So I held off and I was so happy to see that Studio McGee You know put these out for their collection this year They come in so many colors and they are so so soft I joked around with Jonathan and told him that this pillow feels exactly like his uncle's dog who is a golden doodle but i kid you not this is exactly what max feels like and it's just so so soft like a plush bear so this was 22 dollars, i believe and it says it was the 20 by 20 and i think i mean i love it i love the little leather detail and the gold zipper i think this will look so cute like this so very excited about that Last item from Target that I got is the gold tray I told you guys about. I absolutely love this brass color. I had a comment from one of you guys saying to check out Walmart, but I think that Walmart's trays are a little bit too gold for what I'm going for. But I also made sure to check Amazon. And to be quite honest with you guys, at first I thought $20 was a bit pricey for this tray. But after checking Amazon, I mean, that's basically what they're going for so i figured that i would just go ahead and splurge on this because i want this on my coffee table i think it'll be a really good contrast between the wood top and whatever i place on here for decor so very happy about this like i said that is the last item from target the next item is this beautiful candle right here. This is the only thing I got from Anthropology. I actually didn't even know we had an Anthropology store here, but I saw Jess Giffen's um, like decorating video she just put out, and she had this candle turned on like without the lid, and I loved it. I think it gives such a vintagey look. It kind of looks like an advertisement jar. If you guys have seen how much an advertisement jar goes for, they are expensive. I looked for them like on Etsy, on Amazon, and they are pretty pricey. So this candle was $22, which I almost died because it's such a small candle. I really don't think that you need to spend that much on a candle. But what really got me is the jar. Like I said, if you go on um, eBay or on Etsy, they are pricey. So I figured since this looked very closely to a... a one of those jars and even came with the candle i would go ahead and splurge it does smell super good it smells kind of like starbucks to be quite honest and this is the espresso scent it does come in four other scents and colors but i figured this one was the one i liked the most so i went ahead and got it and the lid is also that brass color so just a little bit of a splurge there but i really did love it and lastly let me go ahead and show you guys the items i got at hobby lobby i did head out there this morning today's the first day for the 40 percent off of their fall decor so i made sure to head over because i knew the pieces i wanted were likely to sell out pretty quickly so let me show you guys the first pieces I got are, of course, these beautiful little napkin rings. These are the leather ones with a little gold detail right there. I love these. I know a lot of people love them as well, so I wanted to make sure I got my hands on them before risking them selling out. So this was $1.99, 40% off, so about a dollar. And I did go ahead and get four of them, so 
Here are the four. I love these so, so much. I don't necessarily think I'm going to do a whole like tablescape setting, but for what I want to do, I know those are going to work. So I'm very happy for I got them. Next up are these, um, I don't even know what they are. They're spatulas. It says they are acacia wood spurtles. I don't know. You guys know I love acacia wood. That is the type of wood I use for a lot of my like cutting boards or wood decor. So I thought these were so pretty and would look so good in my crock. And yeah, I really like them. These were $12.99, 40% off. So about $7 or so thought that was a really good price and the last item i am so in love with i actually did not see it any of the times i had previously gone to like sneak peek at their fall decor and i'm so happy i happened to look at the shelf at the right time because this was the second to last one left and it is this beautiful picture right here i love this so much i think this is a such a close resemblance of an ironstone pitcher i think that's what they're called i've seen a lot of my favorite youtubers haul them and i have been curious to get one but i don't really have a lot of thrifting or antique stores near me that i know or am, fam or am familiar with so i was so happy that i found this at hobby lobby this was $19.99 and 40 percent off and i just love that off-white color this is definitely beautiful i am so happy i got it i cannot even tell you guys how excited i was but that is everything for all of the home decor that i got i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope some of these pieces inspired you as i said i will try to um, link as many of them as I can down in the description box some of them I know are gonna be sold out sold out but hopefully I can link them for you guys but yeah that is everything if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you are new and I did not forget let's go ahead and get into the winner of the $25 gift card for the $9,750 you know mark that we just hit that i am so grateful to all of you guys for you guys have no idea how happy i am and how grateful i really really am it's so exciting so i will go ahead and pop up the winner here and it is crystal monique so thank you so much for everyone who participates who leaves a comment who engages in my video who views a crystal if you can please just leave me a comment letting me know how i can get a hold of you but yeah like i said the next giveaway coming up is the one for 10,000 subscribers so for that one it's going to be the same thing i'm going to go to the most recent video and pick a comment the only difference is for this one it is going to be a comment out of the first 10 comments that i get so definitely make sure you have that notification bell turned on and yeah i'm really excited in the case that i were to hit 10,000 before my next video the comments that are gonna count are from my next video but yes I'm very excited I'm very happy it is a, such a dream come true it's such a big goal and milestone for me and I could not be any more grateful to all of you guys so thank you thank you thank you and yeah make sure to stick around next video is going to be a, a clean and get ready to decorate with me and then the following videos are going to be decorating videos so very excited very pumped and very grateful to you guys like I said so I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your your day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!